Hi everyone, <clears throat> thanks for joining me. <clears throat> Losing my voice, I haven't even started yet. That's not going to be good, is it? Right, okay. Let me make sure, oh my gosh, more wobbly. Let me just move that there, I think that's a better angle. I still can't get this flipping camera right since I changed my camera, unfortunately. Right. Let's see who we've got here. Not you, Charles. Bounding across the craft room. I think that's a bit better. I think that's we've got more in shot. Hello, cheeky boy. Right, you're going to have to move out of the way because... Right, move, 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 move. Come out, come down. Oh, you're being a little tinker. Nobody's here, Charles. Where's everybody? I don't know, maybe they're doing the dinner or something. Right, let me share this into my group. Come back out of that. Share. I'm going to share it here. And, oops. Jenny, oops, it goes in. Right, Charles, get off my tablet. Ooh, you're being a little chunker. Hi, Ginny, honey. Right, you need to behave yourself, not you, Ginny. My naughty cat is being a little so-and-so. Right, you've got... Oh, my gosh. No, uh-uh. Oh, my God. Right, come on. Give me a break. Oh, he's being very naughty, Ginny. He really, really is. I do not know what's going on. Right, I'm just sharing this with a few of you. Share it with Pat. And where is Lily? Hi, Tracy, honey. Hi, Karen. Right, where is Moira as well? Let's message Moira and see if we can get her here as well. Because I have some very important news to tell you. Um, group news for um, Chanel's Little Stampers. Oh my gosh, right, okay. Um, I'm not going to tell you till, that, till later on when we've got a few more of you hopefully here. But I do have some exciting group news to tell you all. But we do have a gorgeous card tutorial as well. I'm just having a look at this and look, I've missed a bit there. Oh no, now we've gone and done too much dark on that. Oh my gosh, what have I done? Right, let me just go over this because I don't know what I've done now. I'm going to have to colour this all in. There was a, a bit that wasn't coloured in and then I've gone and used the wrong colour pen. Never mind. We can correct it. There you go. Right. That'll do. Right, okay. You are a tease. I know. I'm an awful tease. Right, okay. Well, I'm not happy with um the lovely um Linny. Let me just... Where is Lynn? Where is Linny? Lindy. Come on, Lynn. Where are you? Right, let's get her here. Yes, I'm not happy with Lynn. Um, she ordered this gorgeous set. I didn't order it and now I want it. Um, so this is not this one. Where is it gone? This is the lovely Lynn D set come today. And I was like, oh my God, can I borrow it to do a tutorial? It is just gorgeous. It is always in my heart and it does come up at that side for a minute with coordinating dies and oh my gosh you should see the dies that come with it so you have all these flower dies to cut out all these flowers and leaves and gorgeous things and then you have this lovely banner die that makes this gorgeous banner that you can fold up it has a strip of hearts and a little strip of hearts as well it is just a gorgeous gorgeous um set and now i actually want it because I've seen some gorgeous, gorgeous cards made with this. Um, they're the floral heart dies and the always in my heart stamp set. 
and these fit on the banner so you can have a happy anniversary be my valentine i was just talking about you lynn i now want this set i could cry um the best kind of friend is the kind like you here's to another ha year of happily ever after you are always in my heart you had me at hello so just gorgeous 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 linny i did put your label on for you i hope that's okay um but i didn't have any magnetic sheets left to put your magnetic sheets but um i have put your label up there <laughs> right we are going to be making this gorgeous card isn't this just gorgeous and colorful and actually really easy to get such a beautiful beautiful card so and then i will be telling you some really exciting news a bit later on i'm just going to wait for a few more of you to arrive right okay so what you will need quite a few bits here so we're going to use a basic white card base which is eight and a quarter scored at four and one eighths uh sorry eight and a quarter by five and a half scored at four and one eighths you're going to need some um dsp i'm using the flowers for every season which oh my gosh had so much use out of it and these are five and a half by one and five and a half by three quarters thank you for sharing you will go into my appreciation jar um for the end of the month so they're the strips you will need some just jade cardstock and i have gone ahead and die cut this gorgeous heart out um you will be left with some hearts which you could keep um because you do need a white one so um i have gone and done the white and took the white heart out of it but you could then go ahead and do the alternative one like that on a green card base and just switch the color up so what you could do is because you need to cut one of these out in white to get this white heart you're left with this so you could then do a just jade card base so just pretend this is a card base and then you could do the different um that way round instead do you see what i say do you see what i'm saying right yeah i think you know what i mean right but for this one we just need the white heart and the green florally bit i hope that made sense probably didn't <laughs> hi linda may honey oh great that's brilliant you only have a few days though for the celebration if you're wanting to order and linda may no 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 oh my gosh so sorry he got the heart and he nearly chewed it to bits don't be naughty oh my gosh um linda may if you do want to order something if you use the host code you will get a free gift from me right so that's what you're going to need the green and the thing and you're going to need some scrap whisper white and you're going to need to stamp uh two of these flowers two of these and three of the um little lily pad sort of ones so you get an um uh oh, what's the word i'm looking for you get an outline for each one so you're going to need to do three of the lily pad and you're going to need to do two of these now you can color these in with um, markers or they do have the inside um the filler in stamps i called them call them so you're going to need two of these of those okay now what's good about these dies as well is that you get two of these two of these and two of these so you can cut them out a lot quicker as well charles stop it so sorry so yes you do get in these dies i'm so sorry Lily, it's stuck down you get two of each you get two of those two of the leaves two of the flowers two of these leaves two of the lily pads so you can actually cut them out a lot quicker you know like if you have to do it one by one you'd be there a little while um right so we do have the infill so we're going to do two in melon mambo um two in magenta madness and i'm only going to show you how we do it with one so you get the infill stamp like that and then you just come in 
and we're just going to line that up like that and then you die cut them out so i'm not gonna make you watch through me doing them all i've already done them um so i use bumblebee magenta madness and melon mambo okay so that's how you do them hi susan honey okay right um so i have gone ahead and done all my bits already honestly this is super super easy i'm going to use a sentiment from another great stamp set which is the hey girlfriend so we've got you can count on me your kindness touches my heart you're a tough act to follow always be yourself hey girlfriend i love my besties so i might put you can count on me on this one i know it's so much easier isn't it what did i put you can count on me so i think i'm going to use this one this time and you can put any um sentiment in the middle so it doesn't really matter where's me just jade gone <coughs> right <coughs> Hi, Lida from Canada. <coughs> Lovely to meet you, honey. And my voice is about to go. <clears throat> I hope it doesn't because I've got some really exciting news to tell you. Right, you can count on me. So we're going to do this just in the bottom here. Like so. <clears throat> I'm so sorry. And then we're going to put this card together. And then I will tell you the really exciting news something we've got coming up on our group right okay now i did this round the wrong way last time so i want to put my um seal on here we're just going to put this down i really want this set now linny what have you done I wasn't going to get this set and now I really, really want it. Right, okay, I'm just going to put this one down like so. And I do love this DSP. Right. Oh my gosh, can you hear my stomach rumbling? Oh my goodness, right. And if you've got any overlapping bits, which I don't, you can just trim them up. And I did leave a little white bit that is deliberate. And then we're just going to take some glue. And I'm just going to put glue on these bits here. knew i would i know i know well you got me looking at this one and i wasn't going to get it and now i want it right so we're just going to pop that down like so hi have i missed you you haven't missed me i am here so right let me just pop this out there's a little bit there that i missed right i'm just going to pop that down yeah, I didn't put glue under that bit last time and it stuck up. And you can always use an old cloth. Like so. There you go. Right. First time catching a live video. Oh, well, it is lovely to see you here, Lida. Um, we always welcome newbies. Now, I did say I have some exciting news um, for my group and it is Chanel's Little Stampers. Firstly, if you're not a member and you would like to be a member, just comment member below and I will send you an invite to our wonderful group. Um, for those of you that are already members, um, just hold fire and I will tell you the good news. Right, thank you also for sharing um, and you will get entered into my appreciation jar for the end of the month. Now, if, like me, you miss a little bit when you die cut you can just come in and cut off a little bit of this white if you want to which i don't like too much of this white going on here so i'm just gonna come in and trim up a little bit of this because sometimes your die moves or something thank you jenny i'm just gonna get some dimensionals on these i've only got my little dimensionals handy but never mind they will do 
and this really is a super fast card are you all holding on with bated breath to find out what my exciting news is you are right i can just tell you're just like come on chanel stop teasing us what is it <laughs> You're going to have to wait, I'm afraid, because I can't concentrate and do more than one thing at once. Right, now, the great thing with this die is you can see it has, like, the flowers there. Um, now, what you can do is cut this out in two different colours. So, cut it out in green and then cut it out in in pink or yellow. And you can use the other bits that pop out here and fill them in. Do you know what I mean? I haven't saved them, so I can't show you. So you can infill these little bits with the bits from the other one. I might do a video tutorial and show you how to do that. Sounds intriguing. Right, okay. Let's pop these down here. It does show you where they all go. I am here. Hi, Sue. Okay. Hello, Denise, honey. Oh, my gosh. Denise is in time for some exciting news. Right, that one goes there. In a minute, where are we? Did I do this right? Yes, I did. That goes there. Sorry, I don't know if I didn't put this down properly. There you go. Right. <laughs> okay, so we're going to pop that one there. I'm going to pop this one here i love this set oh my gosh you could i've seen some beautiful cards omg i'm gonna have to keep this till tomorrow Lenny, and do another one thank you denise honey right so that's all of your flowers put down obviously you can do this in lots of different color combinations um and then all we're going to do is we're going to just do a bow and i do have the just jade ribbon so i'm just going to do a quick bow like a soul oh thank you linny yes i've seen one and i'm going to use oh, some gorgeous dsp and some foil um cardstock tomorrow for one i have seen just gorgeous and of course we've got mother's day coming up so these would make gorgeous mother's day cards as well right so we're just going to trim this up a little bit like so and then oops, maybe just a little bit more gosh my stomach is like going uh, um and then we're going to take a glue dot take this off see how quick this card is and it's a really power effective card right there you go. Look at that card. Isn't that just super stunning? My goodness me. I love it. Love it. Love it. I am now going to have to order this. Hi, Christine, honey. Look at this gorgeous card. Oh, I love it. Love the colours in it. Just super beautiful. Oh, aren't they just lovely? And it's got You Can Count On Me or I Love My Besties. Right, okay, so do you want to hear what the exciting news is? If you do, send me some love hearts, show me some love, and I might just tell you. I want to see the love, though, everybody, please. Come on, lots of love. Hi, Julie Harney. Oh, I've seen some love. We need more love. We need more love. That's it. We've got lots of love. Right. Okay. Let me tell you the news. Oh, Jenny's just sent me a whole heap and so has Christine. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> it was very quick and easy. Okay. Now, those of you that are really active on uh, Chanel's little stampers will know that we have a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful family of friends um now obviously with lockdown and everything you know um a lot of people are going through a lot of things and i think crafting and the group have really helped people 
And I have been seeing on the group where, you know, random acts of kindness have been going on. I know that me and Linny have talked about this and we have actually recently just sent out a rack. Um, but it gave me an idea. I've been seeing things on the group and I have come up with a plan, something new to introduce to the group. Um, now, for me personally, last year was a um, it was a year of friendship. It you know really was, and I know that I started out um, with a group where we made gifts for the heroes for essential workers, and that's how I've got to know a lot of you guys in my group. Um, but I do think that it's very important to also show the people around us, very close to us, kindness as well. Um, and that's our friends, our family, you know, and, and I think there's a lot of that been going on through this. And I think also a lot of us have realised the people that really matter in our lives with going through what everyone's going through at the moment. Um, now, our group is just a group of wonderful, wonderful, wonderful ladies. I don't think we have any men, so I'm sure I'm safe to say a wonderful group of ladies um, that we have. So I've decided that from March, but we're going to start it from now, but it's going to start happening in March, but we're going to prepare for this. Um, from March, I am going to be organising rack bombs now we've all heard of racks which are random acts of kindness but i have decided that we are going to rack bomb two people a month now what does that mean chanel so anyone who wants to take part in this rack bomb um every month i will message private message you all that want to take part the name of two ladies or two people in our group who we are going to rack bomb and what I'd like you to do if you want to take part is to send me a card, um, a tag. It could be, I mean, you don't have to send a card and tag, but you can send something handmade. You can send something, you know, some craft item that you have, some ribbon, some washi tape, anything that you have that you think um, somebody would like to receive. It could be a face mask. It could be some chocolates. It could be anything. And if you send me something for each of those so two people a month i will then put it in a lovely box and we're going to rack bomb them so they're going to receive a big bomb of racks from us all um now if you'd like to take part just please comment bomb underneath in the comments here and also i will be putting something on the group about this so if you want to take part just put bomb on the thing below and um, then every month I will send you the name of two people. And the reason I was going to send you the names is we will get to know each other. So we know what people like, whether they're dog people, cat people, what colours they like, etc, etc. And um, then we can try and, you know, some people will send something that that person will like. If not, you can just put anything in. Now, we're all craft related. We all like crafting. So it could be some buttons. It could be some ribbon. It could be some washi tape. It could be chocolates, like I said, chocolates, face mask, um, a little key ring, anything. So it doesn't have to be. It could be anything that you've got that you think that person will like. So I will send you a message once a month with the name of two people. And then if you send me what you would like for those two people, they're gonna have to be put into two little envelopes or bags so I know which is going to who. And I will then send a box or a package with all of those items for the month to those two people. So I hope that makes sense. We are gonna rack bomb two people a month now i think i invented a new word i've never heard this before if i haven't heard it before and it is out there i do apologize but i do think i just fbi just called asking why so many bombs oh my gosh yeah i shouldn't say that should i oh my gosh should i call it something else i didn't think of that linny i didn't think of that rack bomb i might get booted because i've said that word too much um okay i like that word though maybe i should <laughs> oh my gosh i could get like put in jail or something um facebook jail because of it 
if we can think of another word for it let me know um stop laughing i know i didn't think that i did not think it um i think it's a good idea but maybe the reason it hasn't been um <laughs> maybe the reason it hasn't been invented that word yet is because of that reason oh my gosh um rack what else we could we call it I want people to have an explosion of racks from, you know, from our group. Oh, my gosh, you make me laugh. That's true, though. Um, I don't know what else we could call it, but maybe LOM. Call it a LOM, a rack LOM. Oh, my gosh, I do not know. So if you would like to, yes, I don't think we should maybe put that word in the description. Um. <laughs> I don't know. We're going to have to think of another word, I think, maybe, because you're right. I could get actually, um, I could get put into jail, Facebook jail, because of it. Uh, um, oh, my gosh. A rack raid. That's a good idea. Rack raid. Yes. Okay. Christine Fletcher. I like that. A rack raid right okay so if you would like to take part please change that to raid and not the other word um and if you want to take part i will write your name down and once a month i will send you the name of two people that we are going to rack raid well done christine that does sound better that's why i did not invent that word <laughs> how funny am i right i hope you have enjoyed um this card tutorial and yes you make me laugh and i hope you think that it's all a good idea because um i will obviously add to everything that you send i'm going to make a nice gift to send out um and we're going to do that once a month so at the beginning of the month but what i'm going to do is i'm actually going to tell you uh two people's names in the next couple of days so that you can um start okay right okay raid raid we're hearing raid thank you thank you thank you julie thank you linda may thank you tracy oh my gosh great idea made my day laughing so much linny you did a good job you told me because yeah no wonder it hasn't been invented that word do you know what i'm so blonde look blonde hair i'm blonde i had a blonde blonde moment charles didn't i thank god we have linny <laughs> Linny and Ginny to keep me sane uh, and to keep me on the right track and not from getting put into jail yes can you imagine it right okay we're going to do rack raids very well done Christine Fletcher rack raids okay my lovelies I will be putting something on the group about that um, and those of you that want to take part I will write down your names and I'll be in contact how exciting well we did it for the essential workers but I do think that our friends and everyone that keep us motivated deserve a little pick me up as well oh Charles he agrees as well didn't you Charlie right lovelies I will see you all uh what's tomorrow Wednesday yes I'll see you all Wednesday I'll be doing another card with this gorgeous set thank you for lending me it linny lose and for yes i might have to order it now but thank you all for watching take care for now love you guys bye